Jamie can know the Mr. Kahoto Chisisumi. I'm very sorry, not Mr. Tai GB. GB Kahoto Chisisumi, yes. So, Tai Gi Manuhan Kui Tage, very bold, straightforward, intellectual. At the same time, we see controversial BSC in Kui Manuhan. So, as Jamie can Dimapur to Dekhan, recently Tai Lao Port Ek the press release I na Tai Gi. Tai Kunba Ge Defame Kui Se, derogatory. Words can kuise. Nika kui na ekta press release aise le. Itu toh le kuhima au officer si mene. Itu brai kina thaise. To ami kan sir ki welcome kui aise ek bar. Thank you. Acha sir itu controversial la se Mr. Kahu to G B Kahu to. Itu the apni ki go first. Aavi mai to controversy create na kure do. Nagale the controversy aise do. I only point out the controversies already existing in Nagale. I don't create controversies. Manuhan ki mandu koi apni bisi pok kure. You pok everywhere. Yeah, because everything is wrong. Unless we speak out against what is wrong in our society, we cannot change. So you're speaking out. Yes, I'm speaking out. So apni kotha itu you are speaking out. To itu apni speak out kura ni isne changes kan aye na nae. Aji moi bisi ek ta khushi paato. सोशल मीडिया दे फेसबुक दे इतुला इशू ला टाइम दे ट्राइबलिज्म लो और एक जून दूसरे दूसरे होता ही था कि वो इतु तो एनी नेंजी सोसाइटी वो लेबे बेशी बाग तो इवन द कंसर्न द ट्राइब आउ यूथ कंडो ना दे स्पोक आउ ना इट्स ए वेरी गुड साइन ना ट्राइबलिज्म तो लो हराई जाए ना तो हराई जाए � Kuhima, our officers, union ka press release me. But before that, ajigali aru ekta kotha koi manugan social medias kante kiba kibi likhi dise, kiba kibi uje aru apology letter, summon letter doli. Bisi common ishi kya? What is your viewpoint on that? See, in the first place, ki likhi tha ye? Andaz likhe do. Idu ani apology kuro bolle ulai jai do, galdi doori loi do, na. I've been writing for so many years. Mm -hmm. No, mm -hmm. I don't think anyone has ever asked me for an apology. Mm -hmm. And even if uh, they ask me, I'm not going to give. Mm -hmm. Because what I write, I research. Mm -hmm. What I write is based on what I know to be true. Mm -hmm. if, it, if I am proven false, then I'm willing to not what the apology. I'm willing to go to jail also if necessary. So, uh, I'm going to press note there. Uh, ke Kohima, our officers, union. That they are making by say 11th August 2021. They are making back the basic derogatory. What happened? Who? 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 The present DGP, Mr. John Longkumar, they appointed him against all existing rules. So I pointed out all those. At that time, the then Chief Secretary, Mr. Tim Jantoy, he is in the, on public record. It came out in the papers. The first claim was that in Nagaland, uh, if you have reached 28 years in service, you are eligible to be a DGP. Mm -hmm. So I pointed that out, said that it is false. Mm -hmm. And the second point was that he said, the Minister of Home Affairs, MHA, has given special thing, permission, I mean consideration or whatever it is, to the government of Nagaland to appoint a thing, DGPs who have not reached 30 years in service. So I said, where is it? Where is that order? Uh, okay. Now, those are not facts. Okay. okay. <coughs> when you say something which is not true, what are you? You're a liar. I call him a liar. I call him a liar then. I call him, I call him a liar now. The fact that he, is, he has passed away it makes no difference. Then, okay, let us all uh, make Hitler a saint. What you do, the deeds that you commit today, live on after your death. Whether it's good or bad. Mm -hmm. Just because you die, does the, you do not become a saint. So I don't see why uh, some people are offended. No, I, I see, I don't like the term, the Kohima thing. Mm -hmm. uh, our officers, you know, also. Mm -hmm. 
because uh, I know that this is uh, just a handful. Uh, uh, not even a handful. One or two of them have done, done mm-hmm. this. So according to you, the chief secretary was a lying chief, chief secretary? No, yeah, yeah. So I wrote the uh, lying chief secretary. Okay. Uh. Before? Yeah. No, no, this time. This time. Uh. And before what? In my, uh, before also, uh, last year during the pandemic, uh, I wrote a post. Uh, see, the newspapers don't print everything that I send them. But some things I, I know that they will not print in advance. No? Mm-hmm. So last year during the pandemic, I wrote that uh, Rio and uh, Toei, they will be remembered as long as uh, Nagas are alive on this planet <coughs> and their names will be a hissing and a byword. No? Uh, mm-hmm. So if, if there is anything to be offended about, it is that. Mm-hmm. So according to the union in the press note, ah. they have said you have defamed, right? and you got defamatory allegations. This see, you can say anything, but they have to prove it. So uh, that's why I said sue me, take me to court. So you have evidence. I have evidence. Take me to court. Can we know what are the evidence hmm? you have? I have said it. It's on the papers. No, you know you can. Why? Why? Who uh? kind of the chief secretary lying? Chief Secretary. He lied to the entire population of Nagaland. Point one. Uh, saying that uh, in Nagaland, uh, an IPS officer who can complete 28 years in service is eligible to be DGP. Okay. There's no such rule. No such rule. Uh, he said that the uh, Minister of Home Affairs has given special permission to the government of Nagaland to appoint uh, okay. uh, so unqualified him. DGPs. So that, those are lies. Uh, how many lies do I need to prove my point? Okay. One is enough. I've got two. So, from your side, no apology? No, why? They are not demand, demanding an apology. I don't think they are demanding an apology. Mm-hmm. Uh. They are not demanding an apology? I don't know. I don't know what is the purpose of what they wrote here. Mm-hmm. I, yeah. So, Itiala DGP. Uh-huh, yes. Taila Duki has been issued. 28 years complete. No, no. At the time of his appointment. Okay. Now I filed a case, the concerned people of Nagaland, mm-hmm. we filed a case in the Supreme Court. And the Supreme Court has ordered the government of Nagaland to either fulfill the criteria, criteria. set by the, uh, in the Prakash Singh case of 2006 or file an application. Now we have written two reminders asking the government of Nagaland, have you filed an application? Now I don't know if they filed or not or if they filed and suppressed it. No. Mm-hmm. But they have extended the tenure of the present DGB. So that is again another, that is double contempt of the thing, Supreme Court. Okay. So I brought all this to the notice of the governor. In fact, I told him to take action against uh, the chief secretary also. So <coughs> will the governor take action? That is his uh, thing, uh, decision. Goes under Article 371A1B. He has the power. In matters of law and order, mm-hmm. uh, he is not bound by the Council of Ministers. He can <coughs> do what he wants. Mm-hmm. So, administration and police is entirely his thing, decision. So, to Allah, social activists can, na? Uh-huh. activists can be ambitious, uh-huh. intellectuals can be ambitious, uh-huh. society, the uh-huh. society. Tahan do kill blindfold. I don't know. I don't know. That, that That is not for me to yes, comment on. Uh, but uh, one thing I notice about Nagas is uh, if we come out on social media or if our name appears in the paper, we think that we have won. We have accomplished something. We don't look for the end result. So, um, publicity is all that matters to Nagas, okay. uh, not results. See, I'm still fighting. I've been fighting for two years. Uh, I'm still fighting. You're still fighting. You're moving. Yeah. Uh, anyone can uh, think, uh, point out issues. Mm-hmm. In Nagaland too, there are thousands of issues. In a day, you can bring up 10, 20 issues. Mm-hmm. But the thing is to know which issues are important, which affect the most number of people. Mm-hmm. Now, this DGB issue, it affects every policeman in Nagaland. Mm-hmm. It affects every tribe. How? How do you... Every tribe has a thing, members in the Nagaland police. Mm-hmm. It is their welfare. This is not supposed to be my fight. It is supposed to be the fight of the apex bodies. 
Now, the fact that uh, some officers have issued this, no? uh, now it is for the tribe to question them. Which, whose interests are greater? Uh, the, our police constables at lower ranks are important or one or two officers? Which is more important to the our tribe? Because I am fighting for the benefits of all the policemen in Nagaland. I am fighting for bringing law and order to Nagaland. Mm -hmm. So, confront people of Nagaland. Huh? Do you have any result to think about it? Do you have any plan B? No. See, the result depends. See, if the Supreme Court is willing. Mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm to overturn his own decision, then, the, then that's okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Because that is a, we lose through a legal process, through a constitutional process. Okay. But until that day comes, uh, I'm going to keep fighting. And uh, I will keep on mentioning all the liars, all the crooks in Nagaland. Mm -hmm. uh, all are thieves. I can prove that also. With evidence. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, I can give you a little controversial man. A man of controversy, mm. quote, look. Well, it's not Yeah, because in Nagaland, truth has become a controversy. Truth has become a controversy. Yes. Mm. If you speak the truth, then you're causing controversy. Okay. If you fall with the lies, if you go with corruption, then that's okay. That's no. okay. okay. But you stand for right. Yeah, I'm standing for the truth. Okay, okay we have got a rumors. I'm going to look how what you got on uh. That uh, in this out of the box uh. the topic that uh, in coming next election, uh, Mr. Kahuto or uh, GB Kahuto will be contesting. Is that true? See, uh, when I first started writing on social issues, okay. I thought that okay, if I point out the truth, mm -hmm. people will understand and people will do the right thing. Mm -hmm. If you look at the tone of my letters to the thing, mm -hmm. papers or on social media, you will, early ones I was very polite. Okay. Then when I understood that this is pointless, I started becoming more thing, crude in my language. Mm -hmm. Now you should not look at just what I am now. You see what I was before. Mm -hmm. Then I realized that it is pointless. Uh, uh, Bleeding doesn't work, insults don't work. Mm -hmm. So, along with the CPN was formed later, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Actually, I tried to gather a group of young people to form a political party. Concerned people of Nagaland? No, 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 before concerned people of Nagaland, okay? okay, okay. Uh, I called them, we had uh, two or three meetings, and then we, we said, see, the only way to bring change in Nagaland is to grab political power. Mm -hmm. uh, and even if we don't mm, win, if we create awareness, awareness. Uh, because this clean election campaign is a farce, okay? Uh, NBCC, as always, no, they are fooling the people of Nagaland. They are not Christians. Uh, only the name is a uh, Baptist Nagaland Baptist uh, Church Council. And now uh, the, again, this clean election campaign, no, uh, is just a thing to fool us. When you don't have clean candidates, how can you have a clean election? Mm -hmm. So my idea was to form a political party mm -hmm. to set up clean candidates. Clean candidates. Mm. Mm -hmm. See, it's not necessary that we win, but we open the platform for other clean people to enter the fray. Mm -hmm. Because right now, Nagar attitude is a type of Senaiki election. We true. want to change that thing. Very true. Uh, I tried it with Akavi. I supported Akavi. Mm -hmm. Not because I'm a Madmi. I said it before. Uh, not because uh, I know Akavi, but because uh, the principle, uh, a, man, a person can contest election without having to spend money. Mm -hmm. So that was, we started and then we even named the party, okay, mm -hmm. Progressive Liberal Party, PLP. Mm -hmm. But then this DGP issue came up, so we shelved the political party mm -hmm. uh, and we fought this case in the Supreme Court under the banner of the concerned people in Nagaland. Mm -hmm. So your visions and ideas of this uh, mm. or, or, or forming a...
party is still alive? Yes, 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 of course. It will happen? Uh, yes, it will happen. And your main focus is uh, to bring awareness? Yes. And to project uh, uh, clean candidates? Mm, the problem is whether I can get enough uh, so young so men. No, 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 so I don't mind. I don't need to think. Okay. Uh, I will stand. Uh, they will stand with uh, you. Uh, but the problem is if I can get, if I can get enough young people, mm -hmm. young means younger than me, okay? okay. Uh, or even older than me, with clean backgrounds, who can contest in all seats in Nalan. 66. 66. Yeah. Whether you win or lose? No, no it doesn't matter. Uh, uh, just to bring awareness. Yeah, yeah, bring awareness. Uh, teach the people. See, when the villager, in Nagaland, the po power still lies with the villagers, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, because they vote. No? Uh. Mm -hmm. Now, when the villagers doesn't, when a person does not know what is missing, then uh, you cannot explain to him, no? I mean, he will sell his votes. Mm -hmm. But when you explain to him that, see, mm -hmm. if you're going to sell your votes, uh, mm -hmm. sell, sell it for a price for which you can pay five years uh, <laughs> schooling for your children in a private school. Uh, pay so that in case you get sick, you can, within that five years, you can go to a private hospital. Mm -hmm. uh, ask for enough money to buy a brand new vehicle which can last you for five years in these bad roads. Why for a few thousands? Okay. Uh, ask for a course. Because mm -hmm. it's worth that. Yeah. Okay. Uh. We wish you all the best for a progressive liberal party, uh -huh. your visions, your ideas. Uh -huh. And yes, the message to you. How do you have corruption in the world? This time, you have to apology and summon to protect the message. When you write, when you speak, when you post, first make sure that it is the truth. Then make sure that you will be able to handle whatever pressure that comes your way. Mm -hmm. Because I know how these people operate. Even if, if you're speaking the truth, they will call up your villagers, your clan members, your parents, and they will force you to apologize. Mm -hmm. So, Think of all that before you write anything, anything, before you say anything. If you can handle the pressure, if you are speaking the truth and if you can handle the pressure, then speak up. Otherwise, uh, it becomes a joke. People start laughing at you. No matter how honest you are, no matter how good your intentions are. Thank you so much, sir. Yeah, thank, most you, welcome, thank you. Most thank, you. Uh, thank you for having me.